Wait a second, that's not, that's not Halloween music. Mr. Sandman, bring me a dream. Make him the cutest that I've ever seen. Give him two lips like roses and clover. Then tell him that his lonesome nights are over. Sandman. Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to the channel, it's Dylan, and today I want to speak on something I've seen on bloodydisgusting.com. Now, um, before we get into it, I want to say, this surprised me a lot, um, it threw me away, actually, and, you know, I'm not, I don't want this video to come off as, as me kind of being sour to the idea of Nick Castle not being Michael Myers in Halloween 2018, as that's not it at all. Um, I just want to say now, I kind of had it in my head that Nick Castle would be playing Michael Myers for almost the entirety of the film, you know, bar the, the, the parts where he had a stunt double, but um, it looks like it's not going to be that way. Um, in an interview by BlueDiscussion.com, it says, New Michael Myers, James Jude Courtney, talks Halloween, Nick Castle only cameos as Myers. And then it goes on to say, um, you may have been wondering how the role was split between the two actors and how much of the Michael Myers 2018 is James Jude Courtney and in other words, how much is Nick Castle? Speaking with Halloween Daily News, Courtney just answered that question. David Gordon Green was really sensitive and generous when he said, we're bringing Nick Castle back to do a little work. Do you have a problem with that because you are the Michael Myers now? Courtney's response to that was, oh my god, are you kidding? What an honour it would be. First of all, to meet the guy but secondly to work with him. How good does that get? He continued on by saying, So we started work and I can't remember if it was the second or third week that Nick actually came in and did kind of a cameo. He did a couple of scenes and I'm in scenes with him which is really beautiful. He and I were hoping that would happen because he even said, This is the passing of the torch. We met with some foreign journalists on set and Nick was so super gracious and just saying, Look, I've come in to do a cameo, Jim is our Michael Myers now. So Courtney made it crystal clear that he wasn't merely being brought back to be Carpenter's stunt double. Carpenter? Did I say Carpenter? Sorry, he wasn't being brought back to be Castle's stunt double, but rather that he is Michael Myers for nearly the entirety of the new film. Oh my god, I can't believe I said that, I'm sorry. Um, True tr <laughs> tr to filming, I'm in every scene. I was there almost every day, long days, and it was an extremely physical role. He explains, I started reading this thing about me being a stunt double. I mean, Nick is only 5'10", 170 pounds, and... I'm 6'3", 210 pounds, so I think that'd be really difficult to pull off. It ended off by saying Michael returns home on October 19th, 2018. Now, like I said, um, I guess I kind of had it in my head that Nick Castle was Michael Myers for the entirety of the film, and, and hearing that it, he isn't kind of throws me off a bit. Um, not like I'm, I, I'm not looking forward to the movie now because of it, definitely not. It's just I didn't expect to hear this. You know, it makes a lot of sense, it really does. We can't really have James Jude Courtney as as a as you know a cam or a stuntable for for Nick Castle because they're completely who is right he's six three and Nick Castle is only five ten so it wouldn't work at all but at the same time that kind of means that they have to separate two people as the same character and I, I don't understand how they're gonna do that um will will they have some sort of and, and this is me kind of you know not going off anything just thinking in my head will they have Nick Castle as a 40, not 40 year old, a 70 year old man in some sort of mental institution, maybe a, a, a home um, who is on his deathbed or something like that. And then after he unfortunately passes away, we have James Jude Courtney coming in to be a copycat serial of Michael Myers. 
or a copycat serial killer, Michael Myers. I'm, I'm sorry, I kind of put that very weird, weirdly. Um, but could that possibly be the case at all? I don't, I don't really know if he could. But he said he's coming in for you know cameo, so that doesn't necessarily mean he will be Michael Myers. But with everything I've seen online, even pictures of him um, apparently in, in in the Michael Myers costume, I don't understand how how they could both be Michael Myers at the same time. But yeah, it, it, it's very exciting how, how they're going to do this because I know nothing about Halloween. I mean, sorry, that's that came out very wrong. I know nothing about the new Halloween. You know, I've heard a few things. I've seen some things on Instagram and stuff like that, but I have no idea how this new movie is going to go. And nobody does, really. It's a complete surprise. And and it's very exciting because... And with this news, it's kind of changed things up a bit. And I'm very excited for it, first off. But I am kind of wondering now, how are they going to pull this off? Because we're kind of going to have maybe like a Rob Zombie type type Michael Myers back in it. I'm not saying like mask wise and, and how he's dressed. I mean like we all know Tyler Mayne was like six foot four I believe in, in, in Rob Zombie's Halloween and James Jude Courtney is 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 six foot three so not too far off um in, in all honesty so it could be a similar a similar look but at the same time I don't know um he might not even wear a Michael Myers mask that, that might not be the thing at all you know we we have no idea how this could go down but all I want to say is is welcome Michael Myers to the Halloween community. It's definitely going to be, um, you know, it's going to be crazy for him. I've seen something about Nick Castle, you know, um, congratulating him and, and welcoming him to the Halloween family. As this is big, you know, he's not just a stunt double. He's going to be Michael Myers now. And he could possibly be Michael Myers in an upcoming movie after this. You know, something like a re or not a remake, a, a sequel to this. Or they call it like a prequel or something like that. I don't know how prequels and... and um, stuff like that goes, so I'm sorry, but he could be Michael Myers for a while, or he could be a one-off Michael Myers, it, it, there's no way of telling, but anyway, welcome man, it's it's going to be crazy, I can't wait for the movie, not too much has been revealed, so with that guys, I want to end off the video, and um, I want to say that, you know, in my videos, I'm going to share my opinion on things, and I don't ever expect anyone to, to kind of follow, follow me on that, I don't want you to share the same, well I mean, that's not that I don't want you to share the same opinion. Um, I don't want you to watch my videos and see it as me trying to change your opinion on, on how things might go. We all have our own opinion and I feel like in this channel I, I should be honest and talk about how I feel about certain things. And in the end of the day, my opinion is my opinion. I don't want you guys to, to get mad if I don't agree with you on something. I'll never try to change how you feel. I just kind of want to make it known how I feel as, you know, there's no point in having a personal YouTube channel if you're not going to be personal and, and be honest about what you think so to anyone who might think i'm trying to hate on anything I'm, i'll never hate on this franchise even if the movie isn't good i'll never hate on it and, and that's just the way it is i, I, I don't want to be negative in any way towards halloween or any horror franchise i do not uh want to sh share or spread negativity on the channel it's not something i want to do so please don't ever watch my videos thinking i'm, I'm trying to hate on anything i'm because i'm really not and i don't want that to come off in my video so um i hope you enjoyed i hope you did like the video and um I hope I can catch you on the next one. Thank you for watching and uh, have a nice day everyone.